Hey guys, so I'm going to show you guys my cherry culture haul. So let's begin. Um, I went ahead and I ordered some LA color palettes. Because they were like, I think they're like $3 a piece. Um, normally they sell them around my beauty supply store, but I haven't seen a whole bunch of these so I had to go online and check them out and I've asked um, Elena funky eyeshadow if you know maybe she can help out a girl and see if she can like you know see if she can find some but she said she hasn't seen them it's the same with Giselle so I was like you know what screw it <laughs> I'm just gonna order it whatever anyways um the first palette I'm gonna show you guys now these are all brand new um metallic the palettes the I can't think today oh my god these are the metallic <laughs> eyeshadow palettes that just came out from LA colors there you go I got tongue twisted I'm just still thinking about my shattered eyeshadow which is brand new and oh my god anyways enough okay the first one I'm going to show you is called circus that's that one the next one is called Trop Tropics. Very fun and bright colors. The next one is called Lollipop. Very, very pretty. This next one is called Devious. And this last one is called Ocean Breeze. So that's those. Then I noticed that um, LA Colors now have big eyeshadows. And I was like, let me see what are this what is this all about? And they were it's the same three dollars. So I picked up this one is called Asteroid. These are really really cool. And then the second one I got is called Neptune. So I'm guessing they have them all in the solar system names because that's what they have, the names. Don't mind me, I'm just, I'm a little bit out of it. And then um, I wanted to get the glittering starlit eyeshadow. And the one I got is in Marilyn, which is this one right here. Now if you guys haven't tried LA Colors, try them. They're highly pigmented, especially these. The only downfall about this is that they're extremely glittery. If you guys don't mind glitter, then go with them. Like these are really fun. Like if you want to go out, or if you're crazy like me and you just want to wear makeup whenever, it doesn't matter, then fine. Well, not that I'm crazy, but you guys get the grift. But anyways, um, these eyeshadows are extremely pigmented, um, and they're very affordable. They're only like three, four dollars a piece for the palettes, and that's actually pretty decent for, especially for beginners that are out there. And the palettes are actually pretty cute in the back. They're also holographic, and they're really, really cool. So um, I have this one and another palette. I don't remember the other one, but I wore that one the other day like a couple of weeks ago to work and everybody was like oh my god I love that and I was like whoa because <laughs> I wasn't I normally don't wear my makeup like that to work because it's just too much I normally wear it like to work I wear it toned down a little bit but anyways um but yeah like if you guys are gonna check these out check these out if you guys want me to do another review I'll do a better review whatever just let me know so that's that and then I wanted to try this Amuse palette. This palette is, was only $7. The cool thing is that it smells nice. And this is what the packaging looks like. I have yet to try Amuse products. So I'm going to try them out. I'm not going to say go buy them because I haven't used it yet. But these are what the colors look like. They look very, very fun and bright and colorful. And once I try these colors out, I will definitely let you guys know what the end result is. I'm going to just swatch a couple of eyeshadows just for you guys, just, just to see 
what these colors look like. So far they're pretty pigmented. That's like a swatch with no base on. And that's like a weird angle, but that's what that looks like. So that's that. So let's see what what the end result is on these. And lastly, I didn't get to show you guys this in my last when I did my Victoria's Secret also. I didn't throw this in, but I got this eyeshadow quad. And this one is in closer. Whoops. Very, very pretty. I'm telling you, I'm like the most clumsiest person you can ever know. It's not cool. And then I got an eyeliner because I wanted to try out this eyeliner. It's very, very good so far when I swatched it at the store. This is in dark chocolate. This is what this one looks like. And this is the tip. That's the swatch right there for you guys. And it's very, very soft. And it has a little smudger. So if you guys want to smudge it out. See? So it's actually not that bad. So that's that. And one more thing that I purchased today. I actually got this um, Wet n Wild Quad in Scumptuous. Which looks like this very very pretty wet and wild is upping their game so i am actually pleased i am liking their products now so that's that so i hope you guys enjoy my haul so stay tuned for that and i hope everybody's doing well take care guys bye